Hello again, this is Treble Lobster, and today I will be doing a review on the UNSC Wolverine. Before I get things started, I just want to say, like always, my commentary. This is my actually my favorite set of the Halo Wars ones that I have. Uh, it's like really cool, it has a bunch of awesome stuff. It's one of the new ones that just launched, so it has some new figures in it, which I'll show you in a little bit. And there is actually, if people don't know this, there's new ones coming this fall. There's like new ones, like a pelican and po drop pods and wraiths and stuff. So that's going to be pretty awesome. Okay, so first off, we'll start off with the box. So this is the box. Halo Wars Authentic Collector Series, set number 15. You want to see what we're going to know stuff. You see a Spartan. It's really cool. It's like an overview of all the stuff. Marine going, like what's going on. And there's the hunter. And on the back, it has all that information about the uh, Wolverine, Marines, Hunters, how to put the Hunter together, which I'll show you in a little bit. This, all the other stuff, I'm trying to get the Locust and the uh, Goshog right now. Uh, information right there. And pretty much every set comes with an exclusive brick, so hey, it's the same thing. So that's the box. Okay, now the manual. It only has like 30 pages. It's not that hard to build, really. Like 29, actually. It's not that hard to build. Uh, I built it in like 45 minutes, but I think it'll take like 45 minutes to an hour at maximum for anybody. Then we have the stickers. Uh, I don't get why they have these ones. I mean, the Halo Wars one makes sense, but that one, these two just don't make sense. Now the minifigures. As you can see, we have... A new marine. He's cool. He has if I can just straighten him out for you. So you can see take it. There we go. He has an assault rifle and stuff. Let me show that to you. It's actually really cool. He has this cool whoops. He has this cool little assault rifle. So that's uh, the new one. The other ones have like shotguns or something. Then uh, there he is with all his stuff for the articulated. He, he comes with his backpack like they do in Halo Wars, which is pretty cool. This little pack, you just snap it in that little hole in his back. So that's pretty cool. That's the Marine. Now this guy, the Hunter, he is just wow. He's cool. He has a sp he's put together in pieces, so it, it's kind of hard to push them in the socket, so it hurts a little. He has his spines, his head. Uh, his little shield and stuff. Then he has his little arm cannon that you can, like, move and stuff. Then his legs. He's pretty much the, the same as articulated as anyone else. But let me compare him to the Marine here. As you can see, he is pretty tall. That's compared to the Marine. It's pretty tall. So that's it for the minifigs. Really cool minifigs for this set. Pretty sure you just want to see the Wolverine. This is just like the coolest set I've ever had. It's so, it's just really cool. It's only $30 too, hard to believe that. I just got this yesterday, so. Um, here, we'll start off with this. It comes with these two turrets that go like up and down on each side. They can spin around. Uh, the little cockpit, you can fit the Marine in there. Yeah, I can probably do that for you right now. If I can just bend his legs, I can probably fit him in. Oh, it's not fitting in. It's weird. Uh, sometimes you have to move him around a lot. There we go. There we go. He fits inside there pretty good, so that's pretty cool. Uh, they have rubber tires like in the Warthogs, just they're bigger. Treads on each side. Um, I don't know what these really are. I don't know if they're like rams or something, but yeah, it has those. Cool stickers and stuff. Then um, on the back, you have the tail lights and stuff, and this little bar right here, and all that good stuff. But this is what is like the coolest part. You, know, you can move it around 360 degrees, pivots up and down. And their missiles, and you notice there's these little buttons when you push these. Well, aim at the box, there you go. So you can fire all of those. 
What if I can fire all four at once? I've never tried that. Hey, it works. So that you have all those missiles. You have eight of them. Mm, they go in that little thing. Those little slots. And they go in pretty easily, too. Just... Oh. You just snap them. Oh, whoops. That's one high part. If you're doing this with one hand, it can move. If I could just get it in one of these. Almost got it. There you go. Missiles are inside. That's cool. And you can... Yeah. You can just take them out. I, mean, I don't recommend doing that. I just did that to show you. But there you go. That's the Wolverine, pretty much. Uh, well, there's some other features I can show you. And there's these little steps for the guy, the Marine. That's really cool. The front of it. The front view. That's cool. It's like nice and sleek. The tires work good, the treads work good, so that's cool. You can see the window and stuff, although there's like a window right there. I'm not sure if this is a window or something. He's got good decals, too. It's pretty sick. The stickers aren't that hard to put in like other ones. But that is pretty much it for the Wolverine. I'll be doing more reviews later, and I will also be showing you my custom modified sets. So thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe. I'm taking requests right now if anyone has some. And thank you for watching.